Farmers often spend a lot of money on chemical fertilizers and pesticides. This may give bigger harvests in the short term, but applying these chemicals over a longer time can harm the soil, the environment and the people. Uh, chemical fertilizers and pesticides kill the living things in the soil. This makes the soil hard. Every year I had to use more chemical fertilizer and pesticides. We found it difficult to keep up with the demand of the soil to get more yields or even the same yield. Healthy plants require healthy soil. A healthy soil contains many kinds of living organisms, including good microbes that nourish plants. These good microbes enrich the soil and protect plants from diseases. But chemicals kill these good microbes. Good microbes make the soil loose and help to make the soil richer and more fertile. Plants grow better when I increase good microbes in the soil. Farmers in India prepare various kinds of organic solutions to help beneficial microbes to grow in the soil. They make organic solutions from locally available ingredients at low cost to enrich the soil and increase yield. In this video, we will learn about a solution that boosts the crop's growth and at the same time protect the crop from pests and diseases. Over time, applying chemical fertilizers and pesticides kills the good microbes in the soil and can make the soil hard so plants can no longer grow healthy. We can prepare an organic solution which will enrich the soil and help the crop grow better. Mix fresh cow dung, cow urine, water, proteins and some raw sugar. You can add bitter leaves if you want to control pests at the same time. After 10 days, filter the mix and store it in an airtight container. The filtered mix can be used for seed treatment. Treated seeds will germinate better and resist pests and diseases. You can also use the filtered mix to encourage roots to grow. This will make the plant stronger and healthier. To use it as a spray, dilute 1 litre of the filtered mix with 100 litres of water. Spray the solution once a week or once a fortnight on your crop. Use the solution to spray 15 to 20 day old vegetable seedlings. You can add the filtered mix to the irrigation water tank. You can also apply this solution around fruit trees. By giving good microbes to your soil and crop, you will have a healthier crop and better yields. And a healthy soil will nourish your crops for years to come without the need to spend lots of money.